Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Wednesday which means a new video and it's marking out on a free. I hope you're all doing well in these uncertain times, especially if you're in the UK. I'm doing not well. <laughs> um, in today's video we are going to be restyling a trooper's outfits, whether it is their dance outfits, their talking heads outfit or their street wear. I'm just going to go through a few of the outfits that I personally didn't like for characters and offer a suggestion of what I think they should have worn instead. And linking to the idea of outfits and styling, this video is actually sponsored by Anna Louisa who I actually worked with last year uh, around the same time so I was super happy when they reached out and said that they'd like to work with me again. They currently have their November November Black Friday sale on their website so if you want to go check them out the link is in the description. But you've seen me wear a few of their pieces in videos before like I have a necklace and I have a pair of earrings as well but the ones that they're sponsoring me to talk about and I'm going to be talking about today um, are three pairs of earrings that I've been sent and they are so beautiful like honestly I really do recommend Aunt Louisa. Everything they've ever sent me is always top quality. I really love them and they're also just super delicate because I much prefer the delicate items that they have but they literally have something for everybody. So yeah definitely go check them out if you're interested especially because they have a sale. Like I said they have something for everybody so they range in different stylings but also the price so they start at $39 and they're using literally the best materials they possibly could. They're very sustainable um, and they're also 100% carbon neutral which I love because you know that I'm all for saving the environment and doing anything I can to cut down on stuff and just do my bit for the planet. Even their packaging has changed so now what the jewelry comes in is a cardboard box and it has this really cute quote on it. It just says smaller packaging less waste more love um, and it's actually made from 100% recycled paper and it says please continue the cycle with a little smiley face. So the first pair of earrings that I have are these little drop earrings. I think that these ones in particular would look great with like a block colour outfit or a more dressy top. The second pair that I have are then these tiny little hoops um, and they have this little tiny stone on them which is so sparkly. I love them, they're adorable. And the third pair are my favourites and I actually don't even have them on the card anymore because I've worn them <laughs> about three times already. On these earrings you have one that's a star and one that's a moon. They're so sparkly and so cute but they're also so minimal like you wouldn't notice that they're different unless you looked really close. And as you also know I'm, I love astrology and the stars and stuff like that so literally Anna Louisa are, are winners They're, they have a place in my heart I love them so like I said there is a link in the description to their website you can go check them out they currently have a sale on so you know why not check them out if you need more jewelry that's the place to go I am going to put my little moons and stars in because I love these ones and they link in with one of the characters that I'm going to be redressing and restyling thank you Anna Louisa for sponsoring this video super happy to work with you again um yeah let's get straight into the video okie dokie so we're gonna get into styling our first a trooper and I would actually give them these earrings or an earring of a similar style we're gonna be restyling Summer's season 7 outfit now Summer is a very spiritual person as proven by her oracle cards she likes sweet spots in season 6 we know that she like likes the connection to the earth and stuff moon stars which is why I would give her some moon and stars earrings for her talking heads look. I just think it would be so cute for her to wear something like this and it would be a very subtle nod to how that fits into her personality. Hi! That's actually my favourite sweet spot. Oh, well, I'm prone to finding sweet spots. I knew I liked you. <laughs> the sweet spot on the dance floor is a place where you feel really comfortable and really strong. And I definitely just found that. This is not a game. These are my oracle cards. They let me know what sort of day lies ahead. Oh. Oracle cards really do predict the future. I would also would have given her a different hairstyle for her talking heads in season 7 and her dance um, outfits as well. I would have loved to see some of a ponytail instead of her usual like little top knot with her hair down or half up half down. I just wanted to see something different. I think a ponytail would have been really nice for Summer. Yeah actually so maybe ponytail for when she's dancing and her dance A and B outfits and her talking heads if Sage or Summer had straight hair with little moon and stars earrings or something relating to the constellation and things like that I think that would really suit Summer's personality. So keeping on the topic of season 7 we then have Rochelle and I would have changed for Rochelle her talking heads outfit but also maybe her dance outfit. I just would have liked to see her with straight hair again like she did in season 2 when she first started because initially when we watched season well when I watched season 7 I thought that would be Rochelle's last season on the show so I thought oh you know if she had straight hair and she did some dances reminiscent of her first 
curls ever season that would be really cute so i would have had her have her hair in a straight ponytail to dance in and then her hair straight down for her talking heads I also think that she could have worn a different kind of colour in season 7. Um, I would have liked to see her in something strong like red. Red and black I think would have looked really cool on Michelle. For Kenzie in season 7, I do not like the outfit where she has her shirt around her waist. I just think it's so impractical. And also, if we're trying to think that, you know, they're dancing on different days and stuff, how likely is it that every time she dances she's going to tie the same shirt around her waist? Like, I can get wearing the same leggings and the same top if that's what you're comfortable wearing, but... Tying the shirt as well was just a bit extra for me, so I just wouldn't have this outfit at all. I also would have changed Kenzie's hair because I just don't like it when they wear their hair down to dance with. Like, sure, keep it like the same as what they're talking with, and I guess for continuity, that's why they do it. But it just doesn't make sense to me. Like, just tie your hair back when you're dancing. So instead of tying the shirt around her waist, I would literally just have her have a yellow tank top and the black leggings just without it. Because I like how Kenzie wore yellow. I think that's fine. Um, and for her hair, I was thinking she could have the hairstyle that Summer sometimes has. So she has the top bit in a bun and then the rest of it down. Or she just has it all back. Or even a curly, messy bun. Like, I have my hair in a curly, messy bun today because I need to wash my hair and I just haven't got around to doing it. Um, but, you know, just a different style for Kenzie. I like it down and curly, but maybe just for her streetwear and talking heads. Then we move on to season six. And in season six, it was Piper's red and black outfit I wasn't a fan of. I just didn't really like the top. I don't know whether it is because she had also had her hair up. I just wasn't a fan of the outfit overall. So what I would have given Piper instead is a black outfit to go with it. Because what was... Her other outfit was like a... a tank top on top of a leotard as well like I wasn't a fan of that I think Piper could have worn black for season six because she was very not cold but like she didn't want to go to prom she didn't want to like go out with Finn she didn't want to humor him and go with him to prom she was nervous about everything she messed up her aerial she had really bad self-confidence she was anxious like she had a really tough season so I just think her wearing black would have been very fitting for that so even just like a black leotard with leggings or a black leotard and shorts that she does in parallel world she wears burgundy and black um even just black and black would have been quite cool and it would have been different because piper always wears a color then suddenly she's wearing no color i just think it would have been significant for her character then in season five i'm going to be changing jackie's dance outfit i didn't like the purple top that she wore to dance in the one with the zip i just think wearing zips in general are just uncomfortable and i don't like them for dance wear so i would have liked to see jackie in a long sleeved purple leotard maybe purple and black something along those lines um i just think because jackie was very not closed off but she was very opinionated she was quite arrogant as well that season i just think having long sleeves kind of shows you've got yourself put together you're not very open to change you're not like free and stuff you're very closed off so i just think long sleeve even if the sleeves were like lace or something um that would have been really cool for jackie in season four i there's quite a few i would have changed for season four i wasn't a, a fan of wardrobe overall for season four but there were some people i loved like michelle's dance outfit the black one with the lace on the top i loved that outfit but the ones that i didn't like were emily's outfits i felt like emily looked about 10 years younger than she needed to and i get that they were trying to show that she's now moved on and she's an authority figure as such and she's like older than Riley but she just looked too old like she was only meant to be around 18 and I just don't know any 18 year olds that would wear their hair in a French twist casually or anything like that um, and she wore like a, a shawl thing I, I don't know I just didn't like it much so I would have had Emily's hair straight I also probably would have given her some accent earrings um so I think these ones would have been really nice for Emily because they're sophisticated and they just add a little something to the outfit a similar style to what Riley had when she was going to the conventions and stuff so she wore like a black Laser with a nice dress underneath it didn't age her that much but it just made her look serious like i would have had emily wear the same thing really kind of like the stuff she wears in season six and seven also for season four i didn't like riley's hair when it was curled i felt like that made her look way too old as well but i did like her hair when she actually had it in like a french twist thing at the back but it was a bit messy on top so for Riley, I would have, instead of having her hair curled, just a little bit wavy even, or just down, because I liked it when it was plain down. It looks fine. But like I said, I did like Riley's leotard looks. Also season four, we then have Cassie. And Cassie overall, for her talking heads looked, I just didn't like it. I don't know, I just feel like it could have been a lot prettier. And I didn't really like curls in Cassie's hair either. I think if her hair had been wavy or even straight, it would have made her look a lot nicer. It just 
it didn't do anything for me especially the shirt I just felt like it didn't match her personality she was quite girly and like giggly and she couldn't keep things to herself so wearing a shirt just came out of nowhere for me I would have put her in something a bit floral a little bit ditzy you know um I just wasn't a fan of Cassie's overall outfit for season four so I would have changed it to literally anything so then we have season three and I actually liked the majority of the things in season three but one person's outfit I would have changed is Ella's I didn't like Ella's talking heads look I didn't like the belt and the skirt thing I felt like it made her look just a bit weird it didn't really compliment her in any way so I would have given her just a standard maybe leather jacket and a nice top underneath with a statement necklace or a statement pair of earrings something even minimal like the other pair of Anna Louise earrings I have the little minimal pair of hoops so the thing that I mainly didn't like about Ella was how she wore a jacket to dance in and also she wore leg warmers and it's just I don't know I don't know if they were trying to make it a point like English people wear leg warmers or something but no one on XF has ever worn leg warmers dancing I don't think so I just would have scrapped the leg warmers and scrapped the jacket completely so she would have just been dancing in like a tank top and shorts um but I also liked her other dance outfit so maybe this one could have been like a nice leotard I would have kept her colour scheme to red though because I think red was a very Ella colour like it was strong it was bold it was determined and it just made a statement which Ella did definitely season two outfits i generally liked then for season one i would have given daniel maybe a male leotard like something a bit tighter and a bit more balletic because I think that would have reflected his personality I was very stuck in his ways for season one he wanted to do things his way he was a bit arrogant as well and he was obviously a, ba a ballet boy so I just think that would have suited Daniel a bit better so those are all the people that I would have restyled in season seven to one of the next step I obviously featured some earrings that I have as well to hand um like I said Anna Louisa has their November sale on at the moment so definitely go check them out the link is in my description um I hope you enjoy the pieces that you see as much as I do because I really do love Anna Louisa the jewelry I wear in most of my videos is Anna Louisa I especially love my necklace that I got from them before this video they didn't tell me to mention the necklace but I just thought I would anyway because I love the brand generally um yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you again, Anna Louisa, for sponsoring it. And I'll see you on Sunday for a new video. Bye.